that only requires a Kleenex box, ribbon, the money that you are giving the graduate, and cardstock. And that's it. So you can actually write it if you have better handwriting than me. Go ahead and just write whatever you want to say on there. Mine says, congrats, Heidi. And it says, don't blow it all in one place. Happy face. And then it says, we love you. And then my kids sign their name here but that's what it looks so like so this is a really cool idea i hope you guys enjoy this diy if you want to learn how to make this keep on watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye so all you'll need for this project is an empty kleenex box i emptied out all the um kleenex in here and after i fill it with my dollar bills i'm just going to glue it or you can tape it back together ribbon I was undecided between these two colors, but um, I'll probably use both, or I'm actually just going to use both. <laughs> Some tape. I have these wacky scissors and this uh, cardstock paper that I have that's double-sided. I like these um, crazy colors together with the ribbon. So that's the look that I'm going for. You don't need to use these, but I'm going to use this to cut this out just so it could be a little more decorative while it's hanging from the box. If you don't like the pattern of your box, you can easily wrap it with whatever print you want to use. But I'm actually okay with the print of this box, so I'm just going to use that. And that's it, so let's get started. So I went to the bank and I asked for the nicest... Um, one dollar bills that they had and this is what they gave me so I want her to pull it out of the box this way unless you want them to pull it out this way it's really up to you but I prefer the bills facing this way okay so all you're gonna do is lay your dollar bills flat next to each other so I'm taking a very small piece of tape And I'm just going to tape tape the ends together, just like that. If you want the dollar bills to be, um, you know, wacky, you know, upside down, backside up, you can do that too, but I'm a little OCD, so I'm just going to let them face the same way. the dollar bills all together after you've taped all your dollar bills together I'm gonna use this box so I can measure it all you have to do now is fold it You don't want to press down on it because we don't want creases. We want them to just come down, come out. <clears throat> so. 
smooth like the tissue. So once you get it like this, you're going to open your box. <clears throat> and we're just going to place it in there and pull this top up. And all we're going to do And you can either glue gun this or tape it. I'm actually going to glue gun it. I'm going to glue gun this down. Okay, so I just put a little glue gun here. I mean, a little glue here. And then I'm just going to press down. Okay. So I'm using this polka dot uh, colored stock. I printed this on the computer because my writing isn't so fabulous. <laughs> so for those of you So all I'm going to do, I'm going to use my decorative scissors. I am going to trace this over this. Because I still want the polka dot to peek out through the... Okay, so this is what this looks like. And I'm going to have the kids sign their name down here. You can say whatever you want to say. I just put congrats, Heidi, don't blow it all in one place, we love you. And then our names will be down there. So you're just going to take your scissors and you're going to cut inside... You're going to cut inside, inside the lines. There's a lot more space here, so I'm going to fix that. Okay, then I'm going to take this, and then you can just see that it kind of peeks, peeks out through that. If you're okay with this, then you can leave it, but I'm not. I actually want to cut it down a lot more so you can see more polka dots. Okay, so this is what this is going to look like. Of course, like I said, you can have it hanging off of here. You can actually write a little note in here, fold it up, and hang it from here. It's really up to you. But I just want to take a, cover up this space. So I am going to glue this onto here. So the kids finished signing it and I am just going to glue it to the top. Okay. And then now I'm going to do the bow. thinking I want the bow to be off to the side
I mean, we can put it in the middle. We could put it off to the side. Maybe I should just put it right in the middle. So I just put a little glue here and I am going to push down on this right here. 